Hello, people of the internet, my name is Johnny, and welcome back to another FNAF book news video. This one I'm pretty late on, but honestly, it's not really anything that big. It's just the description for the fourth Fazbear's Fright book, Step Closer. Also, don't ask why I'm on <laughs> Amazon.Canada. I didn't realize I was on here. Why am I? What? So, actually, I don't think we've ever made a video on Step Closer, so I guess we'll read the description, then we'll actually talk about the cover. Five Nights at Freddy's fans won't want to miss this pulse-pounding collection of three novella-length tales that will keep even the bravest FNAF player up at night. Honestly, that sounds about right. I am just about to start the final chapter of Into the Pit, and oh boy, these things are freaking dark. No spoilers though, so let's keep reading. Isolation can open up a void. Pete lashes out at his younger brother in the wake of his parents' divorce, falling prey to a gruesome curse. Casey struggles with the length she'll go to to survive on the streets after stealing a pair of unusual novelty glasses. Samantha and her sister Susie struggle to exist side by side desperate to connect after a horrific tragedy. But in the grim world of Five Nights at Freddy's, empty feelings often attract hungry monsters. In this fourth volume, Five Nights at Freddy's creator Scott Cawthon spins three sinister novella-length stories from different corners of his series' canon, featuring cover art from fan-favorite artist Lady Fizzy. Readers beware, this collection of terrifying tales is enough to unsettle even the most hardened Five Nights at Freddy's fans. Okay, so, <laughs> interesting. Pete and Casey, new names. Samantha, new name. Susie, however. Now that rings a bell. Now going all the way back to 2017, Freddy Faz Bears Pizzeria Simulator. And within that game, there was a mini game that you can play called Fruity Maze. And as you go around collecting all the fruit, there was a girl in the background being stalked by someone. Spring Bonnie. Sp not the girl. Spring Bonnie's not the girl. The, the girl is Susie, who eventually gets lured by Spring Bonnie uh, because, like, he's saying that her, her dog died, and maybe the dog's the mangle. We don't know. But yeah, long story short, that girl is Susie. Whether or not this is the actual Susie, not entirely sure. Younger brother, however, we, d we do know about a younger brother. The crying child. So maybe good old Pete here is the older brother who put the crying child, he yeeted him into Fredbear's mouth at the bite of 1983. Maybe that's why we never see Miss Afton, Mrs. Afton, is because she's gone, she left, she got a divorce with William. I don't know, just a theory. Ugly! It's actually more of a book theory. Anyways, speaking of book, let's have a look at the cover. So this cover is interesting. <laughs> Because it's foxy. This is the only cover that we know of so far, which we know about uh, four, including this one, Into the Pit, obviously. Fetch, with um, with the Fetch dog. Apparently his name is actually Fetch. Then we also have 1.35am, I think it's called, which has Ella on the front. And then we have this book, which has Foxy. The final and fifth one in the Fazbear Freud collection is called Bunny Call. Um, and we don't know what that cover looks like looks like just yet but this one is interesting because it features like a main character that we already know of well i guess you could say we know about um spring bonnie and ella but not really but like foxy he is he's like literally the best character in fnaf everyone freaking loves the guy so it's interesting that he's here and um usually well, I say usually, we only know about one instance, but um, Into the Pit, for example, the first ever chapter in Into the Pit, which has three chapters, is the uh, the one on the cover. So I wonder if um, Step Closer has something to do with Pete. Because if Pete's story is gonna be the first one in the book, Maybe that's why it's called Step Closer. I'm, I'm explaining this very poorly, but hopefully you guys know what I'm trying to go for here. Like, you go to the- you guys probably can't see this, but you go to the table contents of, um, Into the Pit, and the first, uh, what's it called? Oh, it's way down here. The first story is Into the Pit. So maybe, when we go into the table of contents for this book, we'll see Pete's story, Casey's story, 
and then Samantha Stoy. And maybe Foxy has something to do with Pete? I don't know, it's just a guess. But that's really it. Uh, I would tell you the price of this book, but I do not know Canadian currency, so uh, if you guys can do conversions, there you go. <laughs> So this book isn't being released until July 7th of 2020. But even though that is a long time, remember we still have two other books that have to be released in the series. We've got Fetch releasing on March the 3rd of 2020, and then we have 1.35 AM. I did get the name right on May 5th of 2020. So do keep your eyes peeled for all these books. Anyways, boys, that just about does it for today's video. Thank you all so much for watching. Again, don't forget to mark your calendars for all those dates that I just mentioned, and I will see you all on the flip side. Goodbye.